it's me again. Welcome back, Johnny Boy. Um, one of the questions I get asked regular is, well, uh, what do I think of printer-creek concrete? Well, this is my view. Have a look here. If you go back a little bit, Josh, go back. This is printer-creek concrete. Um, it's functional. Uh, aesthetically, I think it serves its purpose, but for me, it just looks a little bit chunky. And uh, one of the things about uh, printer-creek concrete that's uh, quite regular, it has to have this uh, maintenance uh, procedure where you have to seal the top and sometimes you lose the colour. It's concrete, remember, at the end of the day. And once they, they finish doing it, they'll cut these expansion joints through the, the concrete. And I don't think it, it looks good, but they have to have it. Because otherwise, if they don't put the expansion joints, it could crack. So if you have a look at here, for example, you've got weeds growing down on here. Just as you would if you had block paving, there's weeds going through here now, right? It's functional. These people love it here. Um, have a look over here. Come down here now. Your weeds coming through the crack again. Um, and look, this is one of the things that I always have concerns about. If you look here, this is what happens to concrete. And uh, if you've been in the industry as long as I have, you can see you've got a severe crack there. And there's been an attempt to repair it, and it doesn't look good. It doesn't bode well at all. There's another one that's coming through here now. You can see that. And uh, if you come here, that's only going to get worse. There's, I noticed it, look, there we go. There's another one here again. Severe crack right the way through. That's gone completely. You can see it's fractured right the way through. So, functionally, it works. Aesthetically, for me as a designer, it doesn't work. Um, so you have to make your own mind up, but there's some of the pitfalls. There are many more. There are other things that you, you could consider. But uh, for me, no. So. Remember, if you need any advice, just go to the website, which is www.greentoplandscapes.co.uk. Just phone some advice. Or give Alison a ring in the office on 01633 896 007. I'll see you soon.